In tonight's top story, Pentagon officials say 54-year-old Chrissy K. Davis of Talladega, who was employed by the Defense Logistics Agency at the Aniston Army Depot, died Monday from injuries she received during an attack on the Bahram Air Force Base in Afghanistan. Ms. Davis is the first civilian employee of the DLA's Disposition Services Branch to die from combat-related injuries. And that's according to a DLA spokesman. She arrived in Afghanistan on April 25th for a six-month tour of duty and was at work inside the base compound when she was killed by indirect fire early Monday morning. The DLA spokesman uh, Kenneth McNevin tells TV24 that Ms. Davis had been with the agency for 22 years and was on her second overseas deployment working as an environmental specialist. He said her job involved repurposing or destroying old weapons and military vehicles to make sure that they did not fall into enemy hands. In 2010, she served as a civilian workforce volunteer for the DLA in Kuwait and Kyrgyzstan. Before joining the DLA, Ms. Davis worked for the U.S. Bureau of Prisons and the Department of the Army. McNevin says the DLA still has more than 40 civilian and military workers in Afghanistan disposing of old military equipment at three different sites. Another civilian worker was injured in that same attack on Monday, but the Pentagon has not released any further details about the attack.